Here's your 41 Now update, sponsored by Kansas City Regional Association of Realtors. I'm 41 Action News anchor Ray Daniel. Families and friends will gather today to remember homicide victims killed in 2018. The ad hoc group against crime will hold its annual vigil in Kansas City. The names of the homicide victims will be read and leaders from the various faiths will offer prayer and words of encouragement. The vigil will be held at Morning Star Youth and Family Life Center at 5 p.m. Four people are in police custody in Kansas City, Kansas. Police believe they are linked to a double shooting on Thursday morning. Investigators recovered eight guns, one pound of marijuana and gang paraphernalia. KCK police said the arrests were linked to a double shooting on Thursday near 14th in Minnesota. The gunshot victims were able to walk in Providence Medical Center for treatment. They're expected to live. Your forecast is next. Did you know, not all real estate agents are the same. Look for the Realtor logo to be certain you have a qualified advocate on your side. Visit KCRAR.com for more information. I'm meteorologist Jeff Penner with an update. By noon, 24 degrees, mostly cloudy. By 3 p.m., 27, we'll see a little bit of sun. And this evening, it'll clear out, drop to 24. And then by midnight, it'll be also 24. Between 6 p.m. and midnight, it may drop to around 20. And then by morning, kind of holding steady, 23, 24 degrees. The southwest winds increase. Warmer and windy on Sunday, possibly a storm on Monday, New Year's Eve, and an Arctic blast for sure, New Year's Eve night. Stay with 41 Action News. You can get your news and weather anytime on KSHB.com. Cutting the cable cord? 41 Action News is now on Roku. Search KSHB, add our channel, and you're set. All of our newscasts stream live. No other station in Kansas City can say that. Get clear, complete coverage on 41 Action News now on Roku.